Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Craig here from Video Juice and we're back with another Walking Dead reaction. Uh, episode 2 of Season 8. Last time on The Walking Dead, Rick hatched a plan and trapped Negan and basically destroyed Sanctuary. I don't know if it's destroyed, but they led a horde there and trapped Negan. Negan is trapped with Gabriel, so that's going to be fun for Gabriel. I don't think he was wearing a shit in pants. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, it was a good, it was a good plan. It's obviously not over. Uh, other people were the plan was, looked like it was still in motion. Other people were still doing stuff. So I have a feeling that um, I have a feeling that it's part one. So that should be interesting. Um, I mean the whole episode was basically going over the plan. Uh, slowly like slow rolling what's happening with the plan and everything, and then everything finally happened. Uh, we got the, the time. There was a. It looked like there was time jumps anyway, or there was time jumps. Um. One of them looked like a daydream. That was like the, the future one. I do think that that is Rick maybe dreaming of the future he might have, like the future he could have, because we it was cut in between that and a zoom, like a zoom shot of Rick's face, and he had like red, uh, red eyes, looked like he had been crying. So I do think something bad happens in the future, and that's Rick uh, thinking about what he could have if he keeps fighting or what he could have or what he could have if maybe someone died i mean michonne could be dead judith could be dead or uh carol could be dead maybe that's him thinking of the future that he could have had had, had the person still been alive i mean what would make rick ball his eyes out like that i mean it would be someone close to him dying i would assume so it was a good setup for the season it was, it was a very good setup for the season so um, I'm, I'm just really excited to see what's next. I am trying to get a QA and a going uh, for anyone who's new to the channel. Uh, we didn't get any questions this week, but if you do want to participate, give me a question or opinion that you want featured in the recap of the next video, you can tweet at us, TWDQA, or you can check out the description below. There's a link to a forum thread on our website. You can post a question or opinion there. Try and keep them to one or two uh, lines if you can, just so if I get a few, I can spit them out fast. So... I'm going to jump in, watch this episode, check it out, see what it's like, and discuss it afterwards. Let's do this. Oh, actually, before before we do this, I bought a new... Oh, the box is gone. A new Rick pop. We're going to put it up there next to Daryl. I got a few Westworld ones as well. I got Man in Black and um, Bernard. So, they'll be... So that'll be handy for when Westworld comes back. <laughs> so yeah, let's do this. Lock the stairwell, every floor. Why? Ho ho ho! The boys are here. Ho! Oh, you swing that axe, Jerry. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> and fulfill the promise of what we have begun. <laughs> the cave. Hell yeah. Hoo -hoo. Nice. Oh, it's a nice distraction. Oh, oh, they're making bits of them. <laughs> is this what they wanted? I really hope this is part of their plan. Oh. Come on. Oh, they're doing too many close shots at their faces. I have a feeling one of them is going to get shot. Oh, oh, jeez. <laughs> Check that out. 
Oh, is he gonna let him? Oh. And then leave my wife and kids. <sighs> it's so hard to trust them. We know what they do that to people in Sanctuary, but. Oh, there it is. Fuck. Take everything I said back. Kill him. <laughs> Fuck him. How hard it is to piss yourself on purpose? It's like your dick knows you're wearing pants. Oh, oh look at that. Well, that shit is ruined. Oh, and he's a fucking dickhead as well. Oh, nice. <laughs> Show them. Oh, fuck's sake, Jesus. He can't die. <laughs> he got hit, though, did he? He must have. Ho ho! <laughs> He's back. <laughs> Dual wield. Oh shit, the bodies are gonna start turning. I didn't even think of that. Oh ho! That is so unplanned. <laughs> That's so max. <laughs> you got this, Jerry. Yeah! Split like a coconut. <laughs> Shake it till you make it, baby. That's what I've done and what I do. Fake I it because I till you make it. The light to lead my people forward in the darkness. Oh, who is it? Oh shit! Come on, Rick. Oh, <laughs> he's booting him in the face. <laughs> Come on. I'm making such a mess. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> oh, he's gonna put him on it. Face first. Through the heart. That'll do. <laughs> oh, he's fucking ruthless again. Drop your weapon and surrender. That's a lot of guns and a lot of people. <laughs> you drop that gun. You drop it now. <laughs> Sounds good to me. We're supposed to. We surrendered. How, how did he? Not what we do. How did he not just learn? I won't trust, I won't trust any of them. No. Our friends have arrived. <laughs> yes! Oh shit. That was some bad shooting. <laughs> he was right in front of you. Oh. Oh no. I 
fucking knew it. I called it straight away. God damn it. They know we're coming. Indeed they do. <laughs> Ezekiel is quickly becoming one of my favorite characters. <laughs> Oh shit. You were in Atlanta. Yeah, he was original botany. That was a long time ago. It's over, Rick. Oh shit. Don't end. No! <laughs> no! That ending though. <laughs> Jesus. I, I, I didn't recognise him for a few minutes until um until Rick said his name, <laughs> Morales. He um He was he took his family and left before they went to the C V C back in season one, if I recall correctly. That's um that was a big, big twist. That was that was a big shock. I liked it. Um Yeah, we never got closure from his character, so I just, I, I legitimately just completely forgot about him. It's, it's, it's been eight seasons, you know? <laughs> yeah, it's crazy. It's mad that, like, he used to be a good character. I wonder if, I wonder if maybe he, maybe losing his family or something, maybe something turned him. Um, in order for him to go to the saviors and be a, like a, a proper devout member, I'm going to guess he is considering the fact that he's on their side and pointing a gun at Rick and he's like, <laughs> A lot of time has passed. That was um, it was cool. I didn't expect that at all. I'm in very interested to learn more now. Hopefully we get some um, hopefully we get some details on his um, on what he's been up to. It'll be interesting. Um, yeah, it was it was it was a good episode. There was a few things I didn't like. <laughs> the close up shots, the close up face shots that started the episode and ended the episode were a bit weird. I don't really see the purpose they served. Um, but that's not a big thing. It's only a small thing. Both of them are really small things. Another one was um, was Jesus. I wasn't too happy with his conflict with Tara. Um, it seems like a weird. It seems like a weird decision for him to turn around and try to spare everyone, considering the fact that they were talking about the mission and they know how important the mission is. They're up. They're up against the saviors. And then his plan backfired, and the guy who we tried to save turned out to be. The saviors that we know, he turned out to be like one of the saviors that we, we know, root, rootless and just doesn't care. Um, tried to kill him, nearly got him and Tara killed, and then he turns around and tries to save all the rest of them. To spare them, it's like, did you not listen to the speeches that Rick and everyone did before they left? It's like, this is, you need to be killing these people. It was a bit frustrating to watch, um, but they were the only things I was, they were the only things I didn't like. I, I did like. There were some aspects of the Tara and um, Jesus thing I liked. I liked that they were picking sides. Tara was on Rick's side and uh, Jesus was on Maggie's side. I wonder if that's maybe a subtle hint at a future conflict. Maybe there's going to be a split and we're going to have like, you know what I mean? We're going to have like Maggie and the Hilltop and then Rick and maybe they do a split and they have their own people, which would be very interesting, especially if they do have these completely opposite not opposite not completely opposite but these opposite um these opposite rules and uh and things that they stand for so that could be very interesting um it could be very very interesting if that does happen eric getting shot was that was just telegraphed <laughs> the minute they were they, they, like they they kept on showing aaron and then they kept on showing eric and then they kept on doing these Weird, not weird shots, but these shots that I was like, something is going to happen to one of them. And Aaron, I, I did not think it was going to happen to Aaron because Aaron is a bit more of a, he's, his character is a lot more prominent than Eric and a lot more developed. Eric hasn't gotten a whole lot of screen time. So my money was on Eric. And lo and behold, he got shot. <laughs> uh, luckily, he wasn't killed yet anyway. Um, they did need to have a casualty, I suppose. Uh, I know there was a few, but I mean, a proper main, main, main casualty. I know he's not a main character, but he's more of a main character than most of the other people that were there so they needed something so hopefully he thought um 
hopefully he's not gone for good. And, uh, Ezekiel is just be he's just becoming one of my favorite characters. Uh, I, I like him. I, I really like him from the comics as well. So I had a, a lot of expectation and hype in my head for when he was getting introduced and I, I'm, I'm really enjoying his character so far i love this line uh, this episode fake it till you make it that whole thing between him and carol was just uh it was cool and of course he owns shiva <laughs> instant instant win <laughs> oh man i loved their their uh aaron's group i loved their plan You'd go there shoot him wait for the zombies to res i hope that was actually part of their plan <laughs> i'm assuming it is uh that was that was very very that was a really really good idea it was very cool it looks like Crazy Morgan is back, or he's on the brink anyway. He was kind of going over stuff in his head, and he just he seems to be on the brink of going full on crazy again. Uh, and I theorized it last season that the thing that was keeping him sane, or maybe it might not have been keeping him sane, but it looked like his no killing, no killing thing um, was what was like keeping his sanity in check. And now that that's now that that's gone. He kind of doesn't have anything, um, like all of the, the teachings that he had for the no-killing thing that was keeping him in check. Now that, now that that's gone, his mind seems to be collapsing. He went through a lot as well. Lost his son and all that. So And his wife, both during the apocalypse. So that's not easy. But on the plus side, Crazy Morgan was a fucking badass this episode. <laughs> going out just dual wielding the guns, going out just killing everybody. That was uh, It was pretty badass. I, I missed, I missed Morgan. Uh, Full on Morgan and not the. Uh, I wasn't too pleased with his no killing thing. I think it went on a bit too long. I was fine with it at the start, but I think it went on a bit too long. So I'm glad that he's I'm glad that he's uh, <laughs> fully back now. Uh, even if that, even if it is at the cost of his sanity. Oh well. I love that <laughs> when 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 he was coming out with the two guns and he was just fucking mowing down saviors. I liked the. Uh, it was cutting between. Uh, Morgan shooting everyone and Jesus trying to save the people. <laughs> it was uh, it was just a funny, a funny back and forth between the cuts that I that I enjoyed. So yeah, I'm gonna call it at that. Uh, thank you very much for watching. I am trying to do a Q and A. So if you have any questions or opinions that you want featured in the recap of next video, you can tweet at us with hashtag TWD. QA or you can check out the description below there's a link to a forum thread on our website you can post there as well all questions welcome related to this episode please you can like comment and subscribe if you liked the video let us know what you thought about this episode in the comments we have some social media links in the website address down below in the description if you want to check them out as well we'll be back next week with another reaction to the walking dead we'll also have some other reactions and gaming videos on the channel during the week as well you can check them out and um, yeah I think that's it then See you next time. Later.